sweating is an example of homeostasis. Here are 10 specific things you should know for BioSATs. 1. Back pole. What? Biosphere, ecosystem, community, population, organism. Alright, simple stuff. But is soil part of the community? No! Communities are only all the living things like animals and trees and fungi. Soil and all the abiotic things like water and gas and light. They're all the ecosystems grow. 2. Animal fitness. Animal fitness is the ability of an organism to contribute its own alleles and its own physical traits to its own offspring. So when the SATs ask which of the following animals has the highest fitness, look for the one with the most babies. The SATs are tricksters. They'll give you choices like a female baby with one baby lion cares for all other babies even though they are not her. Aw, that's so sweet. But it's wrong. Hardcore male lion who killed 15 other lions with Kung Fu. Oh snap, that's BA. But it's also wrong. Male lion who lives up to 80 years old. Good for him. Wrong. Female lion with five surviving offspring. Yes! Three! Vitamin K is produced in your large intestine by E. coli. Oh, oh thanks, E. coli. E. coli and us humans have a mutualistic relationship. Four! Farbum. No, I did not just have verbal diarrhea with the word farm. It is a mnemonic for the chordate order of evolution. So for the phylum Chordata, the fish evolved first, then amphibians, then reptiles, then birds. Five! Since we're on chordates, all chordates have or had a notochord. A notochord is basically a premature spinal cord. Us humans had it when we were inside our moms. Six! Ligaments versus tendon. Ligaments connect bone to bone and tendons connect bone to muscle. I remember that because tendons are more tender than ligaments. <laughs> Seven! Color blindness is sex linked recessive, so it has to come from both parents, which means the dad has to be colorblind because he only has one X chromosome. But the mom can be colorblind or normal sighted because the mom has two X chromosomes, so the dominant normal sighted X chromosome can actually mask and cover for the recessive colorblind chromosome. Because when you have two X chromosomes, only the dominant alleles show, but the mom can still pass on her recessive colorblind chromosome. So what happens if you have a colorblind son but a normal sighted dad? Well, someone better call Jerry Springer. Eight. Xylem and phloem. Xylem can only carry water up a plant, from the roots to the stem and the leaves. And phloem can carry water up and down a plant. Nine, Mimicry. Isn't that a Pokemon? There are two types of Mimicrys. Malaria Mimicrys when two species look like one another and both are actually poisonous. So when a predator goes like, Oh look, what a colorful butterfly. I think I'm gonna eat it. Oh wait, Big Bird ate one last week and he died. I ain't gonna eat that. Bestesian Mimicry is when one species that actually isn't poisonous looks like a poisonous one. So keep your kids away from them because Bestesians are liars. 10. It wasn't care about your pituitary gland? This is where your growth hormone comes from. And judging by its size, it must not be a very big one. <laughs> hey! Now go back to studying.